Mars is full of life. Or so NASA hoped to demonstrate with the Mars rover, a vehicle the size of a car, set to uncover the mysteries of the Jezero crater on the Red Planet. Perseverance, fondly known as Percy among the team at the Space Center, has been roaming across the Martian surface for nearly a year and a half, gathering samples and beaming back breathtaking images. All of this effort is aimed at answering one vital question, does Mars harbor life? And intriguingly, it just might. In this video, we dive into the findings collected by Percy, discuss the possibility of life on Mars, and consider whether we might have to start packing our bags for the Red Planet. Scientists, known for their rigorous research and factual evidence, raised eyebrows when they suggested that Martians might be real. But what made them suggest the existence of life, human or otherwise, on Mars? Water. The discovery of this basic life-sustaining element on Mars sparked the interest of astrobiologists. They argued that if water catalyzed the evolutionary trajectory on Earth, it could have done the same for our planetary neighbor in the Milky Way. The Mars mission of 2020 had multiple objectives, including gathering geological samples and studying the planet's topography. Still, the primary goal of the rover mission was to investigate if life exists on Mars, or if it ever did. The most promising areas to search were those thought to have once held water. Consequently, any place near a lake or other body of water would have likely hosted the most life. The Jezero, a word meaning water in Scandinavian languages, was chosen as the landing site for Perseverance in 2021. This colossal crater was believed to have once contained a lake. Percy successfully touched down in the crater in February 2021. According to NASA's scientists, the Jezero crater may have been home to Mars's longest river, and the lake it held could have persisted for billions of years. Given that the red planet, like Earth, has been around for approximately 4.6 billion years, there's a possibility that life once flourished on Mars. Even more thrilling is the chance that it might still exist. Meet Sherlock, or scanning habitable environments with ramen and luminescence for organics and chemicals. It's easier to stick with the acronym. This ultraviolet spectrometer, specifically designed for Percy, can detect organic matter in the samples the rover collects. Why is NASA so interested in organic material? Because these carbon-based substances could only originate from the waste or decaying remains of organisms, such as plants and animals. And in recent news, Mission managers reported that Percy had discovered organic matter while examining an eight-mile radius of the Jezero crater. The rover has been gathering samples from various ridges around the crater and found that two samples from Skinner's Ridge and Wildcat Ridge contained the highest levels of organic matter a rover has ever discovered. Sunanda Sharma, a scientist on the Perseverance team, suggested that if the mission's objective is to find life on Mars, these high levels of organic matter could provide a significant clue. Percy is equipped with 43 sample tubes, 25 of which are scheduled to be filled. These samples, stored inside the rover, will be transported back to Earth by a sample retrieval lander for further investigation. This ambitious endeavor will be a joint effort between NASA and the European Space Agency. But now, the Curiosity rover's remarkable images have fueled intense speculation regarding the possibility of ancient life on Mars. One of the most intriguing anomalies captured by the rover is a rock formation resembling a broken carved animal statue. Its distinct features bear a striking resemblance to the shape of an animal, leading some to wonder if it could be evidence of past Martian inhabitants. Similarly, Another anomaly resembles a fossilized skeleton, adding to the fascination surrounding Mars's potential for harboring signs of ancient life. However, scientists are quick to attribute these perceptions to pareidolia, a phenomenon in which the human brain interprets familiar patterns in random objects. In this case, the anomalies are likely rock formations that have been shaped by erosion and other natural processes over time. In addition to these thought-provoking anomalies, the Curiosity rover also captured images of a rock formation that resembles a doorway. Situated on a mound named East Cliffs, this naturally occurring formation exhibits open fractures, with one fracture notably resembling the size of a dog door. The doorway-like appearance sparked wild speculation about hidden chambers or portals on Mars. 
possibly leading to a secret Martian refuge or even an interdimensional gateway. Nevertheless, some scientists temper these speculations, proposing that the feature is likely the outcome of sheer fractures resulting from the strain exerted on the Martian bedrock, an occurrence frequently observed both on Mars and Earth. But these discoveries weren't quite as groundbreaking as the first time scientists hypothesized that life could exist on the Red Planet. In 1996, David McKay and his team claimed they had evidence of Martian life. Their evidence was a rock, closely guarded and treasured more than gold, named ALH 84001. McKay and his colleagues believed this rock had been ejected from Mars, journeyed through space, and landed in Antarctica, where it was discovered by geologists. The debate sparked by the discovery of the Martian rock divided both scientists and the public. Today, the scientific community is split, with 75% believing that life existed on Mars billions of years ago, around the time when the Jezero crater dried up. A smaller group believes that life may still be present on the planet, while a tiny fraction believes there has never been life on Mars. Perseverance, armed with cameras, microphones, and samplers, has been tasked with gathering over 43 samples, recording frequency waves, testing for oxygen, and more to help settle this debate. Alongside Percy, a small drone named Ingenuity arrived on Mars, assigned with the job of collecting airborne samples and data. So far, it has completed 29 flights, setting a record for the longest flight on Mars. Could we seriously inhabit Mars? Elon Musk, the eccentric billionaire entrepreneur, has long expressed his ambition to colonize the Red Planet through his space manufacturing company, SpaceX. However, scientists caution against the idea of permanent relocation to Mars. Despite its potential for past life, Mars is now a planet in decline, lacking the necessary resources to sustain large-scale life like Earth. Its inhospitable terrain and atmosphere pose significant challenges for human habitation, including the absence of breathable oxygen and available water. Moreover, the high levels of cosmic radiation make it difficult for human life to thrive on Mars. When imagining what a Martian might look like, popular depictions often lean toward pruny, large-eyed beings. However, these portrayals are more fiction than reality. If Martians did exist, they might have evolved to be taller than humans, adapting to the demands of a harsh environment that required physical strength and competition for limited food resources. The colder Martian climate could have led to the development of body hair as a means of insulation. Additionally, Radiation exposure might have influenced their eyesight, potentially leading to protective adaptations. As Perseverance continues its remarkable trek through the Martian landscape, it remains dedicated in its mission to seek out evidence of life. Equipped with advanced scientific instruments and an unwavering spirit, Percy embodies humanity's insatiable curiosity and thirst for discovery. Every step taken, Every sample collected brings us closer to unraveling the enigmatic secrets of Mars. The findings thus far, while not providing conclusive proof of past or present life on the Red Planet, have ignited hope and spurred further exploration. Who knows what astonishing revelations the future holds for us in this uncharted frontier of our celestial neighbor. If you found this video interesting, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more fascinating content. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below.